when in doubt, I always say, go, go ask, ask, ask the the closest woman in your life. Mm-hmm. She'll tell you correct whether it works or whether it doesn't work. Is mm-hmm. women, if you smell good, they they come to you. They yeah. will come to yeah. you if you smell good. And if, if you, you stink, bad, you stink. So yeah, I I don't see a lot of dudes rolling up on me saying, "Hey, Cortez, you smell good." <laughs> How you doing? And, It'd be kind of awkward, mm-hmm. but usually, I, you know, I mean, let's be real, man. We, we wear cologne to attract to attract the opposite sex or to attract some type of comment from the opposite sex. Mm-hmm. And, true. and if you smell it, man, I was in a restaurant, man, Zanzibar Blue, many years oh, ago with yeah. my wife. Shout out to Zanzibar Blue. God bless them. And one of the waiters, it was so deep. One of the waiters, he was a real good, excellent waiter, man. My wife pulled him down. By his shirt collar, she was like, "What kind of cologne are you wearing?" Damn. I'm sorry. Excuse me. <laughs> I knew that was coming because I, I feel See, this man, is a red pill, blue it, pill it moment. GPS. It wasn't that kind of situation, oh, man. Boy. You about to take it? No, 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 no. no. This, this I, I, I mean, I know I heard what I heard. <laughs> yeah. I just need you to repeat what I heard. My wife, we're inside of Zanzibar. This is the one up in Wilmington, mm-hmm. and the, the waiter is doing an excellent job. Mm-hmm. She's and my wife pulled him down. She's like, I'm just curious, what kind of cologne are you wearing, sir? And he told us the kind that he was wearing. And she's like, You gotta get some of this stuff. This stuff smells good. Wow. And I, I went out, I went out and I bought it. I used Chanel, Allure Chanel. Mm-hmm. That's expensive. It's, it's expensive stuff. Mm-hmm. But you know, I started putting that on, man, and I started getting all all types of comments and everything because it was it's a it's a clean smell, it has citrus and everything. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That is true. And you know, if my wife didn't say anything about it, I probably would not have got. I would not have went out and purchased it if my wife didn't say anything about it. Okay. Well, GPS, your your rebuttal on that one, real quick. Oh, all right, cool. I, I just wanted to make sure I heard what I heard in the context in the context that I heard. It. Okay, okay, yeah, no simp in here. There's no simp in here. It was just an. Oh no, there ain't no simp because yeah. I'm telling you right now, that waiter, he been listening to EO. Okay. <laughs> that waiter, he been listening to EO. Okay, because he wears that probably on the regular. Yeah. And who knows what his tips are like. At the true. end of the night. That is true. That is true. So, so let's let's now get the female perspective of this. Uh, Marsha, welcome, welcome. Uh, hey, better late than never, but it's fine as um, long as you're okay. Honestly, I'm with your wife. If a man smells good, you like, yo, this is the best thing since sliced bread. Mm. Um, so, um, and it doesn't always have to be very expensive, but I know there are some expensive ones out there mm-hmm. that, um, like Creed. Creed is expensive. Yeah. I was actually asking you because I, I plan on buying it for Damon. For uh, his birthday, yeah, it's you know. like about about three hundred at oh. least. But uh, but you know, like I said, for me, when you're on a budget, sometimes the travel size, there's nothing wrong with that. So that's why I said, shout out the micro perfumes because they are good, and you can choose from whatever the oh, new nice. ones or the or the classic ones that they have on their website. Yeah. So um, but it's about the pheromones, how your body reacts with the cologne. Correct. They really is it because you know it might smell good on that waiter, but. It may sm- stink on Chris. You know? Whoa! Jesus! <laughs> well, telling the truth. I knew it was coming. It, 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 it Cause it don't. It doesn't smell good on everybody. That's the thing. Like, it's your body chemistry. Yeah. You know. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it totally is. So, uh, so that that was. Uh, that's our. Uh, segment here for confidence breed success it's about the colognes i mean you know cologne does make demand just like a suit makes demand but when you put them all together it really makes a dynamic person it really makes it come out i mean so you got to do your homework you got to look for all the different things look at it take a whiff of the different notes because there's not just one type of a note which is like the smell that you get it might be a uh uh, uh sandalwood on top then it might be a citrus on bottom or vice versa because it all reacts to the chemicals in your the oils in your skin and you know you have to do a lot of homework but if you just don't have all that type of money go to a place like micro perfumes and check it out try it, it it's gonna be great gps i think when you're on a budget and you're trying to ball on a budget you know you don't have to impress anybody it's about being making yourself feel good so if you go to a place like this you can try hundreds of different types and not have to shell all that money for buying one bottle 